come along with me to the final day of a week in the life of a Cambridge neuroscientist. Today is actually a really nice chill day. I'm mainly going to be working from home on some corrections to my latest paper, so addressing some comments from the editors and reviewers to make sure that it can hopefully go out for publishing. Okay, I've been at this for like a few hours now, a good few hours, so I have managed to get through all of the editor comments and I've gone through and made some of the changes because they're like not huge changes, but they're things that take time, like fixing figures and references. I'm now going to stop and look at something else and have some lunch and then come back and sort the review of comments in the afternoon. Wish me luck. I did manage to get all the reviewer comments sorted that afternoon and also went through the quite frustrating process of submitting another paper. It's just so many finicky little details that always need finishing off. And with that, it's the end of the work day and the work week. So I finish off with a bit of workout and call it a day. I hope this series has been informative about what it's actually like to work as a Cambridge neuroscientist. It's certainly never an environment I thought I'd get to work in and I absolutely love working here. Don't get me wrong, academia and science has its highs and lows. It's an absolute roller coaster, but I wouldn't change it for the world. Hopefully see you for another week soon.